What's up, everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, I got a cool little video, and uh, I really do mean cool. Uh, but before I get into today's product, uh, I want to show you guys something. You remember Ski? I, I mean, I forgot about this soda uh, forever ago, made by the Double Cola Company. And uh, you can still get Double Cola. You just, uh, like, usually have to find it, you know, order it. Or I think you can get it at Cracker Barrel. But other than that, it's really not readily available. However, Ski, though, uh, you can see they got this gold cap. And uh, I've been trying to win me a... Free, I don't know if you can read that. It says try again. A free ski. Uh, so far, I've gotten three of these in the past week. And I did get a free ski. However, um, the store I got it from said they didn't have to honor it. So I was like, fuck you guys. That's ridiculous. Anyway... <clears throat> So refreshing. I haven't had skiing forever. But I'm not trying to be too much of a fat ass and buy a bunch of ski. I'm a sucker for free things. You know, if I'm going into the store and I'm already going to buy me a soda, I'm going to try and see if I can't win me something. Win me another one. Anyway, I just wanted to show you guys that because I miss that. You know, Mountain Dew used to do that stuff way back when I was in like middle school and high school, they would do it every now and then. <clears throat> but I'm glad to see somebody still doing it. Anyway, uh, I got off work today and I had to stop by Lowe's and uh, really, I had to stop by Lowe's to pick up a few things and uh, they had a Duke Cannon display, okay? So I'm going through there and I'm fingering all the products. I'm going through everything. I'm seeing, you know, basically the same thing that I already have. All the same products, all the same soap, all the same beard oils. The only thing, there was a few things that I did not have. And that was like uh, some of the little scrubbers and some wipes. And, uh some like gift sets, but I didn't want to buy a gift set because why well, I'm not gifting myself. So, uh, after looking everything over, I did find something. And that is this Duke Cannon aftershave bomb. Now, um, at first glance, this isn't really much to look at, okay? This is not, this looks like your mom's lotion on the side of her bed. You know, uh, it's not really anything to, you know, look at. However, uh, I just got out of the shower and, uh, I shaved my neck beard, okay? I shaved down here to get rid of all the nasty stuff. And, uh, I thought I'd give it a shot. So... Let me just explain a few things, okay? First of all, this is aftershave balm, which I've never really heard of, okay? I've always heard of aftershave, but I've never really heard of a balm. I'm not saying it didn't exist until now. I'm just saying I've never heard of it. Um, ice cold, menthol to cool, shea butter to hydrate, alcohol free, reduce redness, razor burn slash bumps, and tightness. Uh, that's cool. Okay, that's... I'll take that. Oh my god, what are you doing? My dog keeps getting up and down off the couch. Anyway. Duke Cannon knows a proper shave goes from hot to cold. That's why he created an aftershave balm so cold. It feels like you face-planted into an Alaskan snowbank little bit of an exaggeration. It's not that crazy. It's not like you just, you know, gave your neck frostbite. Uh, 
Closes pores and soothes the skin without any irritation. Most ladies will find the fresh scent of bergamot and sandalwood rather appealing. Alcohol, sulfate, and paraben-free. Okay, great. Perfect. Uh, not for clowns, once again. Trademarked. If you can... Anyway, there's uh, also the ingredients uh, right down yonder if you want to pause the video and take a look at that. If you can even read it. If not, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sure it's online. Uh, so, this is six fluid ounces made in the USA. A portion of proceeds benefits U.S. veterans. That's another thing, like... Uh, Duke Cannon is not one of these companies that is known to be, uh, all natural. So if that's your stick, uh, you know, you're probably not going to find it with them. However, you cannot knock the company for at least doing something. You know, it may not be a massive, uh, it may not be a massive amount of money towards, uh, veterans. But, however, uh, they're doing something. You know, that's a whole lot better than probably your favorite, you know, soap company. So, uh, yeah. Now that I've went through all that, let me just get into uh, the smell, okay? So the smell, it, it, it literally says menthol to cool. So I was assuming that it was going to be like this um, very, like, strong, almost like ice cold to the nose but it's very, very faint. The menthol that they speak of is very, very faint. Now you can tell it's in there, but very, just a very little small bit. Oh, got it on my nose. And that's why I said, you know, when I when I shaved my neck and I, I applied it afterwards, it wasn't like A new experience, okay? It was like I put on lotion. Maybe a little better. I will give it that. Maybe a little better because of the menthol. But other than that, you might be able to just use lotion. Maybe alcohol-free lotion. I don't know. Uh, but... I feel like that I'm not necessarily one to need aftershave or like aftershave balm because my skin doesn't necessarily like uh, react negatively towards me shaving, uh, especially if I'm using like a good shaving cream. My skin doesn't necessarily, and plus if you shave like the right way, your skin doesn't necessarily get like crazy out of whack. So, you know, I take my time shaving my skin. Every now and then, you can't help but nick yourself every few, every handful of times, you know. Uh, and I, I feel like that might kind of help with that. Maybe help stop the burn. Uh, but, it, you know, it smells good. It uh, applies good. You only need... You know, uh, a, a droplet in your hand, it'll go a long way. Uh, but let's see what the price says, okay? So I went to Lowe's, like I said, and uh, check out, it was $9.98. After tax, it was $10.58. So $10.58 for this six fluid ounce. For this six fluid ounce container of aftershave. Guys, I'm going to have to say it. Don't buy it. You can do better. I'm not saying that it, it's like a bad product. It does what it's supposed to do. But there are equally or if not better products out there to buy. That's like maybe half the price 
okay? Keep that in mind, okay? Uh, I kinda wish I didn't buy it. But I got it, I'm gonna use it, and that's that. Uh, but I also kind of feel like aftershave has kind of been one of those things. Like, us millennials don't... I, every other person that I talk to who is around or, you know, the same age as me, they don't even use aftershave, okay? Um, that's more of like a, a an older person thing. Not uh, and don't take that the wrong way. If you're if you're elderly or older and watching this, because I'm getting old. But you know, like it, like let's say uh, some of my coworkers. I know for a fact the people. It seems like the men, like forty and above, definitely use aftershave. And you know we've had this conversation before. Uh but. Some of the young bucks, including myself, didn't necessarily use aftershave. I got it now, and I'm going to use it because I spent uh, almost $11. So, yeah, I'm going to say if you uh, find it, and if it works really good for you, that's great. Keep doing it. Keep doing you. Uh, but for me personally, mm -hmm. if... Uh, my skin starts getting out of whack when I'm starting to shave, and I don't have this no more. I think I'm going to go with something else. So, uh, that's my opinion. Thank you guys very much for watching. Sorry if this video was a little bit... Uh, I'm kind of out of it. I'm extremely tired. Work 12 hours. Come home mow. And, uh... Feed the dogs. Feed the wife. Anyway. Thanks so much for watching. Duke Cannon is an alright company. Ski Soda is delicious. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.